Good morning. <clears throat> I sound and look a whole lot better. Um, I haven't took any medicine just yet, but the day after I'm, um, I'm sick, I always wake up better, but it just gets worse <laughs> as the day goes on. So I try to hurry up and take medicine and just sort of nip it in the bud before I get started. There's some crazy lights going on. Um, I got to finish putting all the groceries up. I thought Cody put them up, but he just put up the, um, the cold stuff. So I had to go in the refrigerator. So that was a big help. So thanks husband, <laughs> but he doesn't know where anything goes. So I'm going to put the rest of the things up. Um, make me a little bit of breakfast. Y'all know I really don't eat hardly ever, um, when I'm at home, but, um, when I finish putting the groceries up, try to clean the kitchen up some, make me some kind of breakfast. I got bagels. I got some sausage. Might scramble me an egg. I don't know. We're about to see. Probably need some coffee because I think I slept. I don't know. I think um, Cody woke me up this morning to tell me bye like he always does. Ignore my cabinet. I don't know why I opened it. Um he woke me up this morning like he always does before he leaves for work and i was so out of it that i didn't even know it and then i heard him when he closed the door and he walked out and i was like he left and i just started calling his name like a sick little pitiful dog or something like dog can dogs can talk anyway um he was like what is it and i was like you didn't tell me bye and he was like yes i did <laughs> i woke you up and i was like well i I missed it. I didn't hear any of that. So he came back in and told me bye. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was so out of it. So I don't think I got up to like 1030. And I don't really remember when I finally went to sleep. It was a little while. It might have been like 12. 1 o'clock maybe when I finally went to sleep. I'm telling you my, my sleeping schedule is all out of whack. Even when I'm sick and have taken medicine I can't still seem to fall asleep. So, But when I finally did go to sleep. It was good, so, um, yeah, I'm going to get some stuff done, quit, quit rambling, and, um, I'm going to catch up on some YouTube videos here shortly. Favorite, favorite part of my Monday, ladies eating, if you hear that crunching in the background, so, let's get some stuff done.
Okay. <clears throat> Made it to the couch. <laughs> and we are going, I'm debating on whether, I'm actually gonna eat my breakfast right now. My eye. Has anybody else put hot sauce on their um, scrambled eggs? <laughs> You're probably wondering why did I cook all those sausage links. I figure it's just since I have a hard time eating, it's a lot easier for me to just have them pre cooked, sort of like meal prepping, and just grab a couple and pop them in the microwave later on in the week rather than trying to pull out a skillet and cook them because sometimes I'm not in the mood to do all that. So. Anyway, I'm debating on finishing Stranger Things or catching up on YouTube videos. I think I might just have to finish Stranger Things and then watch YouTube videos as I do laundry. I think I might do that because I have to fold up some laundry. Just get ahead of some stuff. But the kitchen's clean. Since we weren't here this weekend, it made it easier. I just popped everything in the dishwasher and just let it go while we weren't here. So, um, yeah. Also, super yummy lemon water. If you noticed a little trick I did, I cut all my lemons up and I put them in a bag and I put them in the freezer. And then during the week, I just pop them in there. And it's sort of like killing two birds with one stone. If you don't know what that saying means, it's like um, a two for one. So it's like I get the flavor from the lemon in my water and it also acts as a ice cube just to keep my water cold. But I do still love these little Dollar Tree um, water ice cube things that I've told you about in one of my last vlogs. I can just drink water a lot more when it's in this cup um, especially when I have lemon in it. I can drink like 10 bottles a day, <laughs> which might not be the best idea ever in the world, but I'm going to eat my breakfast and, um, watch an episode of Stranger Things. I'm on episode seven, so I hate that I only have one episode after that because I don't know when they're actually going to bring it back. kind of sucks that the whole season was only eight episodes. Like, what happened to like... 19 or 20 or, or even even 10 like give me two more episodes so I'm just gonna chill out for now give myself a little break and try to recuperate some hopefully um, the achiness in my body will go away and I can just do what I need to do for the rest of the day so <laughs> Oh my I'm starting the last episode now it is so crazy like how long is this one okay so this last episode is longer than all the other ones it's 54 minutes the other one's like 40 minutes so 10 more minutes of craziness I do suggest that you watch this. Um, I know a lot of people, it's very popular right now. Um, there's a reason why it's popular. I mean, we started, I was a little hesitant in watching it because we had so many other shows we were watching, but I'm like, it's only eight episodes and all our other shows are um, waiting to come back on, you know, so we're like in between shows. So um, we started watching it this past weekend, me and Cody. And um, we watched the first two episodes. He didn't really like it, which is why I was like, okay, I'm just going to finish it by myself. So, um, I really like it. At first, I'm going to tell you, like, the first couple episodes, I was like, what is this mess? Like, what is even happening? I was so confused at first. Um, because I feel like it's based in, like, the 60s or the 70s. So, the time frame is a little different. Um, it was just really it was just really different but as you get to like the third episode everything sort of starts making sense so things start piecing together and i'm on episode eight now which is like i said the last one that they have on here yet just right now i guess i'll be adding more but um yeah they're pretty much like explaining everything at this point but it keeps you on your toes and i am super interested in seeing what happens 
so I don't want to give any spoilers away but I highly suggest you watch it if you've watched it let's have a conversation about this in the description not description not the description in the comments below um, if you've watched it especially if you watched the whole thing because um, I'm about to finish it now so here we go It's gone. <sighs> I, I don't want to spoil anything, like I said, if you haven't seen it. <sighs> but I'm just ready for the next season to come on now because I want to see what happens. I mean, they pretty much ended it. They, you know, whatever happened, they ended it. So I don't want to say what they ended, but it wasn't like they're letting something linger into the next season. There's a little bit that they're letting come into the next season, I feel, from what I've just seen. But the main stuff, they pretty much, you know, explained everything. So I don't know. I don't know what to look forward to. Ladybug, come here. Lazy, come here. I slept the entire time. Yeah. You're falling. <laughs> You're falling and you can't get up. Mm. It's lunch time now. <laughs> lunch time now, lady. Lunch time now. You got the sneezes too? Well, um, I will not be cooking dinner tonight because we have some leftover baked ziti. Um, and Cody has softball practice after work. So he'll be late anyway. So I'll just pop that in the oven and warm it up. So, um, yeah. Super duper lazy vlog. I did clean the kitchen though. But I am, I think I'm going to go do the laundry now. So, you guys don't want to see that. <laughs> so, me and Lady are going to sign off. Aren't we, Lady? Yeah. She always knows when I don't feel like the best. You're the best. You're the best. Oh, well. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. So sorry that the energy level was super down. I guess the weather is in the midst of changing. Falls right around the corner. Um, I'm going to blame it on that. So we're just going to say it's it's the weather's fault. That's, that's always what I blame it on. So it's the weather's fault. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. You have a wonderful day hope none of you out there are sick and experiencing all the wonderfulness that i have been experiencing so hope you guys have a beautiful and blessed day and thanks for watching